Joining us now here on the MMA Report on Radio Influence, man is going to be looking for his third straight win coming up on September the 11th in Japan. He's going to be fighting at Pancras. It's Tateki Matsuda, who's 12-7 and seven in his career. Second time fighting in Japan. First time since 2012. Tateki, as always, appreciate the time. You know, First off, uh, what's it mean to you to, to be able to go back over to Japan and, and show uh, how much of a, of, of a different fighter you are now as opposed to 2012? Yes, uh, back then uh, I couldn't find an opponent in local, and uh, I asked my manager in Japan, and then he eventually found an opportunity, and um, yeah, that was a lot of a real experience. Uh, I was born, re- born, raised in Japan, but uh, uh, I was like a foreigner, you know, and uh, the promoter tried to match up with the Japanese fighter, but no one didn't take it, and then uh, I fought against a Korean guy. So, uh, uh, <laughs> I won the fight, and uh, it was a you know good experience. And now my twenties, uh, tw- yeah, twenties fight in Japan, uh, and also the first time go uh, fighting against a Japanese guy. So I'm very excited, and then uh, get the victory and. Um, you know, bring the W home here, and then uh, also show what I've been doing in the U.S. to the Japanese MMA fan. I remember the last time we talked, you, you had kind of talked about, you know, especially there in the Northeast where you train at, it can you are kind of at that point where it is a little tough uh, to find fights. Is is pretty much are you almost at that stage now that you might have to be looking at taking uh, international fights just to to get fights? Uh. Actually, uh, I, I I was ready to uh, fight, uh, you know, this this summer, but uh, uh, my immigration status was changing. But now now I'm settled. Like now, uh, I, I'm I, all I have to do is just wait for the uh, the permanent resident card. So, uh, but back then, like I couldn't uh, travel from the U.S. because of my status. But now uh, I'm free to travel. Uh, I'm free to work for any organization. So, uh, and then the, my manager Tyson uh, had been negotiating with the, uh, you know, the many different promotions. And then uh, Panther uh, gave us good opportunity. And then uh, now it's the time to fly out from the Massachusetts and then just, you know, get back back to the you know busy routine and uh, uh yeah that's uh, the winning uh is very uh, important to me so just i just get back at it and, and the opponent coming up here tetsuya so who's 14 and 15 and four draws uh in his career he's coming off a win back in march of 2016 but that was his first win uh since uh since 2013 what, what's your thoughts uh, of your opponent here Oh, really? Uh, I mean, I I I know the name, uh, but I didn't really know that. Like, uh, but you know, the fighting record doesn't really matter. Uh, mm-hmm. He's still fighting. That means like uh, he always re- ready to, you know, uh, beat somebody up. So, uh, but I I didn't know that he just got the win, and uh, so you say he didn't win the since. 2013 or something. Yeah, yeah, he had. Uh, he had I, I, yeah, I, 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 I don't care. Uh, if the if the, his fight is available online, maybe I, I'll look up some. But uh, you know, this is a very uh, mental sport. So, and, um, I, I, I'm sorry, I, I don't really have a thought against my yeah. opponent. But uh, yeah, because I'm very focused on my own fight camp. Yeah. So uh, yeah, I'm very uh, um uh, especially uh you know the time difference and get jet lag. Uh, you know Japan is my hometown, but the perform for the Japanese MMA promotion is very different for me. <laughs> you know, uh, I'm obviously they treat me as a foreign fighter, and uh, I'm not used to their custom and uh, the the way they you know uh, 
manage the show. So uh, all, all I worry about is my conditioning and then my, um, you know, the like weight making and then, uh, uh, you know, all the schedule was settled. Like uh, nothing happened. Like I just want to, you know, everything clean. That's all I'm looking for. <laughs> do, do, you know, because of obviously the, the time difference between here in the United States and in Japan, will you, will you head out a couple of days earlier just to kind of get your body adjusted to the time difference? Yes, that's, that's my time. Um, uh, I don't know. I, uh, the, how, how many days before the fight, but, uh, I already talked to my coach and, uh, my corner and, uh, we're gonna, we're gonna fly in Japan a little bit earlier. And then, uh, by then, like I should be ready because I've been very busy in, in this whole summer. So, uh, mm-hmm. you know, just be smart, no injury, nothing crazy. And get there, get ready, make weight, and just fight. Is, <laughs> and is, see my family. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of the term. Yeah. For, it, it, for you, is is this something where, because of your last fight being in February, this fight being September, that you're kind of just, you just want to get back in there. You know, it, it's you, you just want to get back in there and obviously help kind of build that resume to get back to the UFC? Oh, sure, yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, uh, as I as I said, uh, I tried to have a fight um, uh, last few months, but uh, I couldn't. And uh, so, uh, well, all I look for is just just go go hundred percent, get to win in uh, September, and um, and uh, stay healthy and just stay busy with mm-hmm. the tanker. That's my plan, and uh, and see what what's gonna happen next. And, of course, uh, this fight coming up here on September the 11th, as you'll see, Tateki. Look for his third win in a row. Tateki, as always, appreciate the time. Good luck in the fight, man. Thank you. I appreciate it.